Hello and welcome to this tutorial on Odoo WooCommerce application. In this video, I'm going to show you how to import products from my WooCommerce store to Odoo. When importing products from my WooCommerce store to Odoo, you need to make sure that all the products in your WooCommerce store need to have a unique SKU value. If you're managing variable products, you need to make sure that all the variations have a unique SKU value as well. We only import simple product, variable product from WooCommerce store to Odoo. Let's consider a case scenario where I have all my products available in my WooCommerce store and those products are not available in Odoo. Now, before importing those products from my WooCommerce store to Odoo, I would need to set certain product configuration in the Odoo WooCommerce application. So let's go to the Odoo WooCommerce application. Go to configuration and settings. The first field is use sales description of Odoo products. If you would like to import the sales description from WooCommerce store to Odoo, and after importing, if you would like to update those description from Odoo to WooCommerce, then you would need to activate use sales description of Odoo products. After activating it, go to select instance field and select the respective store. Then go to the product configuration. If you want to import images and prices, from your WooCommerce store to Odoo, you need to activate these two fields. Now, since I do not have my products in Odoo, I will have to activate automatically create Odoo product if not found. So what this does is, when I'm importing the products from my WooCommerce store to Odoo, it will automatically create the same product in Odoo as well. If you're managing different weight units in your WooCommerce store, you need to select respective weight unit from the drop down menu. These are the necessary product configuration you need to set up before importing the products from WooCommerce store to Odoo. Now, let me show you how to import the products. To import the products, go to the dashboard, click on perform operation. From the operation menu, select import products. And from the products to import, select import all. So you have two options. One is import all, which is going to import all my products from my WooCommerce store to Odoo. If you select new and updated only, this is only going to import the products which have been updated recently or have been created recently in your WooCommerce store. So in my case, I'm going to import all the products from my WooCommerce store to Odoo. If you do not want to update the existing products in your Odoo, you have to select this option and click on Execute. When importing the products from my WooCommerce store to Odoo, it is going to create a product queue. Now, this queue can either be processed automatically or manually. If you want to process the queue manually, you can click on Process Queue manually over here. Click on Process. This is going to process the queue manually from my WooCommerce store to Odoo. However, if you wish to process the queue automatically, you can just leave the queue like that for a minute or two and it will be automatically be processed. Once the queue has been processed, you'll be able to see a process banner and you'll be able to see done. So if you go to your WooCommerce dashboard, you'll be able to see all your products over here. And if you click on it, it is going to show you all the products. Apart from the application, you can also see these products in your Odoo sales or inventory module. So let's go to the sales application. Let's go to products and products. As you can see, all my products have been imported from my WooCommerce store to Odoo along with the images and the product name as well. So if I go to my WooCommerce store and if I go to my products, as you can see, I have 10 products. All these 10 products have been imported to Odoo. Let's consider a case scenario 
where I have my products available in my WooCommerce store, the same product is also available in my Odoo. So how do I sync those products? When syncing the products, you'll have to make sure that the Odoo's internal reference number and the WooCommerce SKU value needs to be the same. Before syncing the products, let's manage few configuration. To do that, go to configuration and settings. Select the instance from the drop down menu. Under the product configuration, you'll have to deactivate auto create Odoo product if not found and click on save. I have a product bottle which is available in my WooCommerce store and the same product is also available in Oju. I would like to sync both of them. If you go to products and products over here, the bottle product has not been synced right now. So let's go to the inventory application. Let's go to products and products. As you can see, I have the product bottle. The internal reference number for the bottle is bottle. The same product is also available in my WooCommerce store. So I have a product bottle. Its SKU value is also bottle. So I would like to sync these two products. To do that, go to Odoo WooCommerce application, go to perform operation, and from the operation menu, select import products and click on execute. It will create a product queue. Now this queue can either be processed automatically or you can process manually. To process the queue manually, click on process queue manually over here and click on process. However, if you wish to process the queue automatically, just leave the queue like that for a minute or two and it will be automatically been processed. Once the queue has been processed, if you go to the dashboard, you will be able to see the product has been synced. If you go to products and products, you'll be able to see the bottle product which has been synced with my Odoo product. Let's consider a case scenario where I have my product available in Odoo and in my WooCommerce. However, the Odoo product internal reference number and the WooCommerce product SK value are not the same. So how do I map these two products? So I have a product in Oju called wallet. The wallet internal reference number is wallet underscore men. The same product is also available in my WooCommerce. The SKU value is wallet. So how do I map these two products? To do that, go to the product wallet. Click on WooCommerce, prepare product for export. From the export method, you can either select export in CSV file or export in Excel file. So let's select export in CSV file and click on export product. It is going to download a CSV file. So let's open the CSV file. As you can see, we have a column which says product default code which represents Odoo's internal reference number. We have another column which says Woo product default code, which represents WooCommerce product SKU value. So my WooCommerce product SKU value is wallet. So I'm going to edit that and I'm going to save it. Once it is saved, you'll have to go to the WooCommerce application Go to perform operation. From the operation menu, select map products. Over here, you'll have to upload the file. And click on execute. Once you click on execute, you'll be able to see the product under the products products menu. As you can see, the wallet product has been exported to the WooCommerce application. If you can see, all the products have been set to tick apart from the product wallet. The reason why it has not been ticked is because the product has not been mapped with the WooCommerce product. To do that, go to WooCommerce dashboard, go to perform operation. From the operation menu, select import products and click on execute. It will create a product queue. 
Now this queue can either be processed automatically or you can process the queue manually. To process the queue manually, click on process queue manually and click on process. However, if you want to process the queue automatically, you can just leave the queue like that for a minute or two and it will be automatically been processed. As you can see, the queue has been processed. So let's go to products and products. As you can see, the wallet product has been mapped with my WooCommerce wallet product. 